whoop, 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 whoop. Hello, internet. Welcome, welcome back. I'm a factor of change. I use he, they pronouns, and we are getting ready to continue our stream of the Final Fantasy II Pixel Remaster. I believe last we left off, we were sailing away, um, trying to uh, give everybody the family therapy they need and rescue the princess once again. The uh, trope's getting a little old. <laughs> I'm hoping in the next uh, game there won't be too many princesses to rescue, but we shall see. It's been a trope in video games for far too long. <laughs> um, yeah, I think uh, without further ado, we'll get started. Emmy, it's good to see you. Welcome in. Let me get this set up. And there we go. Looks like my closed captions are working without tinkering. I'm happy about that. Sometimes it just decides it doesn't want to read that screen anymore. And then I'm like, why are they not working? All right. So, load all game. Oh, yeah, we did get Lena back in our party. So I think my priority right now is really to just work on getting leveled up a little bit. I feel so weak. Oh, have I gone to this town yet? I might not have actually gone to this town. I honestly don't remember. We could have never recaptured Finn without you. Thanks. You guys took out the big boss, huh? Wow. Being able to live here again is like a dream come true. Finn is ours again at last. The standard of the Wild Rose flies high over Finn once more. Oh, I think I also need a white mask from the castle. What you got for sale? Dispel removes barriers. Okay. Teaches the mini spell. Fog. And slow. Uh, thank you, stream closed captioner, but we're going to skip that for today. We have a different captioner built today. Uh, teaches the soul spell. Should I buy these? Why not? We're just gonna distribute them. So fog will give to Ferion. Dispel will give Guy, our Himba white mage. Mini will give to Maria. And slow will also give to Guy. Why not? Does somebody have the toad spell? I think I'm running out of room. Yes, Maria has the toad spell. Shriep. Is there any armor I can get? You've been to Paul's house? Certainly seems overjoyed. It's no wonder he probably had all sorts of stolen loot stash there. <laughs> Paul's naughty. Don't forget the part we played in taking Finn back. Okay. We may have taken Finn back, but the war isn't over. The decisive battle will be fought once Minu returns from Mysidia. What you got? Ooh, gold. Gold, gold, gold. We like this. Um, get some of those. Why would you wear... Oh... Is it resistant to poison? I think I'm gonna go with the golden armor. Yeah. How about weapons? The wear buster I have. I don't have a flame bow. Should I grab it? Mm. I think I'm good on those for now. Quite a few of those items. 
Oh, I don't have any elixirs because they're so expensive. Alright, I think Paul's house is this one. Let's see if he has anything cool to offer. Oh no, that's that church. We don't want the church. This one must be Paul's. Looks like it. Theory on you, old devil. How you've been? Do you think about any of these items? You need to know secret doors. I'm your man. I don't suppose you could tell me what's inside the secret chamber. Just curious. The white mask? That doesn't sound particularly valuable. Nope, not interested. So I guess I'll tell you where the door is. Look in the far corner of the audience chamber to the right of the throne. So you're collectors too. Just what do you need a mask like that for anyway? Well, my secret you don't need. Dreadnought, airship, mithril, wild dress. Okay, he doesn't know any of those things. Okay. So we need to go back to the castle. To the back of the audience chamber. Like here? Oh. Um. Key items. What do I use? Oh, weird. Small gap appears in the wall. It's a secret door. Boy, it's far down, isn't it? Oh, that's how you get over here. I get it now. There can be bad guys down here. Yes. Why wouldn't there be? Glory holes, that's what you're gonna find here. Oh no. <laughs> I hope there's none of those down here. guide I have up is not quite correct. Let's go back a chapter. The castle goes with hidden passages, there's a hard tone. All right, fan basement. Wild Pianseer appears. Hmm. Staircase bottom leads to the basement. Castle Mercy goes to the right side. Got that. Wait a minute. Castle Pillars. So I'm on the right wall. You should find a hidden passage to the grass? Well, I don't know where that is. So all of the doors, with the exception of one on the bottom floor, lead to empty rooms. Okay. So I don't need to open any of the doors. Just go down the stairs and get treasures. Alright, I can do that. A pan sear sounds like something you cook? It sure does. It sounds like something you would see in uh, Cooking Mama. 
We should stream that sometime. That would be a fun game. So silly. Oh look, now we're all cool dudes with our glasses. The Panzer escaped, boggers. Eye drops for everybody. Dark Meow, it's your boy, Dark Meow. Welcome, Dark Meow. What's up, buddy? Just playing a little uh, Final Fantasy 2 here. Oh no, Hemi. <laughs> oh, that was helpful. Some more eye drops. Oh, you're sick. I'm so sorry, Dark Meow. I hate getting sick. This is the time of year where it happens, at least up here. Everybody's indoors more all over each other breathing. He drinking lots of uh, chicken noodle soup and taking things easy. I obtained clothes. I think that's really pointless. Oh, your sister got you sick. Oh. I'm sure it was not intentional, unless it was. <laughs> oh, you can relate with Faye. Oh, no. It is making the rounds, for sure. Emmy, you think sisters suck? I think sisters only suck when there's questionable parenting. <laughs> Ooh, what are these guys? They're like little brains and eyeballs? I don't like that. Dark Meow says, I have three brothers and three sisters. I am the middle child. Nice. I'm in a weird birth order in my family, so technically I was born first, but raised by my grandparent, that made me the youngest. Emmy says, at least your sister wasn't the COVID dispensary in your area. Oh no. Your poor sister. She's made some unfortunate life choices. Yep, Emmy is the middle child. Oh, it literally is called a brain. That's funny. I hate them. They're really creepy. Not a fan. Your sister follows me on TikTok, believe it or not. Punch, punch, punch. Slash, slash, punch, punch, punch. Chop down those brains. Maybe I should consider putting on some more shields. I don't know. Ambushed. That was rude. 
Look at Layla, her hit points are half of mine. Oh no. <laughs> Poor thing. Don't worry. Himbo guys got this. Uh, Emmy says she didn't like that my mom found her TikTok and mom watched everything. Why is your mom watching everything? She's gotta get some boundaries. <laughs> <laughs> There's no need to watch everything. Oh, yeah, there's another staircase. So we want to get those at the bottom. A killer mantis. Kind of looks like Scyther from Pokemon. Scyther! Green souls. They're not so strong anymore. I think it was the red soul that was tough. Most, Emmy says, most of my sister's content was about my mom, so you know she loved. Oh dear. <laughs> yeah. I think everybody just needs to learn better boundaries here in this situation. <laughs> I tell folks I work with that boundaries are a way that I tell you I love you. This is what I need for us to be able to continue our relationship. I think it's healthy. Is this the only thing on this floor? Is it Killer Mantis? It's an interesting mob. A flame shield. It seems that. They hit pretty hard, but I have a lot of HP at this point. Well, everyone but Layla has good HP. <laughs> Another killer mantis, who would have known? I suppose I could give them more shields, but I'd rather them put out damage. Spider silk, what's that do? Uh, gives the effect of slow. Okay. Punch, punch, punch! Alright, more stairs. So we got treasure chest up top. Treasure chest top right, and then a treasure chest by the door. Ooh, these are different. He's a little tanky boy. Trying to put me to sleep. What a rude boy. It's gonna take a little while, I think. Uh, Mantis is the only killer after it's gotten... Yelp? Praying mantises eat their partners after... Yeah, yeah, they do. This is a biological fact. Don't hurt the toities. I have to. They're pretty strong, though. Look how much they defend against my hits. There's another one. Wow, that was a good hit, Maria. Nowhere near as obnoxious as the uh, 
turtle in what is that dungeon? Ooh, it's a party. What's that dungeon in 14 where you have to fight the stupid turtle with the cannons? Stone Vigil? Hard mode? That was something good. A power staff. Staff made for striking. Okay. Does that have any spells? No. Is that better for you? It is better for Maria. Alright, alright. Anyone else wearing a staff? You're wearing a staff. Nah. You're wearing a staff, too. We'll give it to you. We'll give it to Guy. <laughs> Stone Vigil hired. <laughs> you know, that battle's not so bad if everyone just does the mechanics. Ouch. Be running. <laughs> My typical enjoyment in a Final Fantasy experience is to become so overpowered that the mechanics aren't going to matter anymore. <laughs> That's why it's a little difficult to play this particular game, because you don't... I don't know how to min-max. Because <laughs> it's so different. Where are we going? We're going over here. Toity. Sorry, Mr. Delaney. It must be done. You trying to run? That's rude. A diamond shield? Who's wearing a shield? You're wearing a shield. Resistant to the lightning. So it's the same defense. Okay. I was hoping that would be just a stronger shield. Flame armor. Armor wreathed in flame. Who has the lowest armor? Furion? We'll give it to Guy. Oh, it drops his evasion, though. No. All right, Maria, you have amazing evasion, so we're going to give it to you. Stone Joiner appears. Ooh. So icy. So much ice. Punch, punch, punch! Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
<laughs> they love their ice. Bye. that one? No, he didn't. A betrayal fang. Causes confuse. Okay. They have so many random items. I don't know what they're for, really. Is this the bottom floor? It appears to be the last floor. Okay. We're gonna look at our guide here. A single treasure chest, obtain a force fire. Okay, so this is the Orcalcum. Finally, when you reach the corner, you'll see it says six doors. All doors except for the second from the right lead to an empty room. Only the second door from the right leads to anything worthwhile. The hallway where the white mask is stored. Additionally, there's a warp tile above the chest which brings you outside the castle, so you don't have to backtrack. Okie dokie. That's handy. So apparently this is a really good weapon. I think the Orichalcum is the um in Chrono Cross, I think there's a set of gear you can make with Orichalcum. Punch punch punch! Oh, I went down the wrong hall. At least these guys go down pretty well. <laughs> Getting a decent amount of gold though from these encounters. It'll work well later when I need to uh Spend it on some expensive magic. Bunch. Slash. Cut. Cut. Nice cap. Hey, karaoke girl. How are you this evening? Come on in. Ooh, Rios. They look like, um... What do you call them? The Chimeras, just a fancier model. So we want to blink and protect. What do you got, girl? Nothing worth it. Doing well, doing well. I am doing just dandy. It was a good day. I was uh, able to go through my emails. I whittled down almost 1400 emails to just over a hundred <laughs> so that was an accomplishment to say the least for me today <laughs> the little glump for you all right um that's not good. We've got everybody stoned. Get our golden needle. Oh no. That's not good. Um. Okay. Let's try Maria. This bad breath is pretty bad. Game over. <laughs> I don't know if I have a way to defend against that. We might have to come back and get that weapon later. 
there anything in this guide? Clearly power breath weapons that can turn your fire into a stone. They're strong offensively. They aren't particularly well defended. Okay. Guess we'll restart. Oh! Look at that! The game auto-saved to the floor. <laughs> oh, goodness! What a wonderful thing for them to do! I don't have to backtrack and redo all of that progress. Sweet. So, question is, do I want to try that again? Let's go and sort our armor. Let's see, is there anything poison, ice, lightning? No. Mithril, leather, poison, silver, copper, bronze, strength, mithril, leather, bronze. Yeah, I don't think I have anything that will defend against. <laughs> nope. Those are dark bow, though. Wooden bow. Okay, and those are all items. So I could try using one of those other spells. I'm going to try it again. No loss, really, to come back right to this area. Although I do wonder if it still counts your items that you used. I don't know. I don't know. How about you, karaoke girl? How's your uh, how's your week been going so far? Punch, punch, slash, slash. Full of unexpected surprises. Ooh. I hope they weren't all uh, undesired surprises. <laughs> all right, let's try this again. They get to go first, that's rude. Magic, what do you have? Fix amnesia. Stone. Hmm. Banishes the target to another dimension. Curious to see if any of those spells will work. I doubt it. Yeah, I don't know how you would get through this. Uh, Carrie Girl says they were certainly interesting. Not anything that I could not handle, but a lot of extra work. Ooh. Extra work, no bueno. We got one of them dead. Okay. That's good. Ouch. He's almost dead. Good deflection, Maria. She is so amazing. Magic. 
Um, yeah, you cure it as well. You attack and you attack. I can take that. Two down, two to go. Okay. What do you have that I could use? How much does a high potion do? 500, that's pretty good. Blaze. Blaze I can handle, it's that bad breath. It's clutch as a blue mage in 14, but not fun on this side. <laughs> Alright, cure. Cure. Attack, attack. Yeah, keep blazing, that's fine. It's the breath weapon I'm scared of, but bad breath. Oh gosh, I did it, I did it, I defeated it. Sweet. James or a Calcum. Yep, it's a knife. I know who to give that right to. Layla. Oh, let's uh, heal up, shall we? Okay. So we want the second door. This one. Nope. That was a lie. Oh, okay. Second door from the wall on the right. Okay, okay, okay. They meant this door. More stalactites. Well, I hope, uh, Karika Girl, things are chilling out for you. Uh, you know, tomorrow is Friday. Grab a cozy beverage and a little snacky poo and just relax for the evening. You found the white mask. All right. Thank goodness. We want to go to Mysidia, I think, now is our next destination. Which, oh, how, how strong I feel <laughs> going there. Walking near there was scary enough. All right, let us go rest in the inn. Get our MPs back. Yay! Where is our boat? Okay, our boat's down there. Where we want to go anyway. Ha! Ah. Poor babies. They definitely seem to be getting stronger. I just... The leveling in this game confuses me. Don't understand it. Do you even dare? Okay. Okay, that wasn't so bad. Oh, 
Oh, this is not Mysidia. This is the Mysidian Tower. Darn, I thought it was just going to be right there. <laughs> all right, all right. Where am I supposed to be going then? Oh, it's down there. Okay. Silly me. Magikarp. gonna just quickly save here just in case this turns out to be a mistake vampire girl how cute I love her maybe I won't love her if she kills me but I love her she's so cute look at her oh This looks like the city. Okay. That wasn't too bad. Oh, we come from the top this time. This is Mysidia, Kingdom of Mages. You've certainly come a long way to be here. I just want to make sure I'm not going to lose Layla anytime soon. Doesn't appear so. No. Okay. Is there any cool gear here? Knight's armor. Thief's glove. Giant's gloves. Do. Um. So he's wearing that. So buy another one of those. Some knight's armor. His evasion goes down to 15. Hmm. But his defense goes up to 41. Yeah, we'll give it to you. And we're gonna keep you in your flame armor. Definitely seems like an upgrade there. Oh yeah, look at that, 69 evasion. That sounds good. Bet you there's some rare magic in Mysidia. Oh my god, there's five counters. Okay, so those are the basic tomes. We're gonna buy a couple of those because I have a feeling we're gonna get some more people later. Cure, blink, protect, shell. I have those. Ooh, these are different. Holy? Teaches the holy spell? What? Swaps HP and MP with the target when used in battle. Wall. Cares against magic attacks. Barrier. Defends against elemental attacks and status ailments. Ooh. I want all of them. <laughs> well, maybe not the swap. Teaches the life spell, sap. All right, somebody has each of those. What do you got over here? Fear, Asuna, Esuna, and Silence. I have all those. All right, we're gonna give Guy the Holy Spell. He's our good guy, Himbo, White Mage. We'll give the Wall Spell to Firion. The barrier spell to Maria. Yeah, 
And how about weapons? What you got for weapons? Ooh, a power staff. Is there somebody wearing a staff right now? Flame Lance, the Overkiller, and the Ice Bow. What weapons are we using? So you've got two swords. You've got a staff. You've got a stave and a trident. You also have a stave. So let's get two staves. One of these. And one of these. So Maria, you already have that. You need the power staff. We'll give you a flame lance. Upgrade you to a power staff. And that drops your evasion. Or we'll replace that with Ogre Killer. Why did that change that? That was weird. Giant's Helm. Okay. Everybody's put their armor up. I believe it as you say. The time to break the tower seal is upon us. Three artifacts protect the seal on the tower. We've many ancient texts in our town. Please browse them at your leisure. A statue of a goddess is enshrined beneath the city. She watches over the crystal rods. Some time ago, a wizard named Minwu passed through town on his way to the tower. You'd best hurry after him. A very small island lies in the middle of the sea. There you will find the black mask, the white mask's counterpart. Okay, I know where that is. Oh, many old books line the shelves. Guess we're asking the bookshelf things. <laughs> uh, in ages past pandemonium, the palace of the Lord of Hell emerged unto our land. The mages of old wove a spell of fearsome power and banished pandemonium, averting the crisis. However, the mages feared that the spell was so powerful it could throw the world into chaos. So they constructed a great tower and sealed within it the tome inscribed with the spell's secrets. Make of the white mask an offering to the goddess beneath Mysidia. If thou art pure of heart, the doppelganger will cease to move. Fit then the black mask upon him, and both he and his defiled heart shall fade. Fearing that the tremendous power they wielded might lead to the world to destruction, the mages of old founded the settlement in Mysidia and have dwelt here in seclusion. Close relative of the dragon, the wyvern is strained to serve as the airborne mount of the dragoon. Though smaller than a dragon, the creature's strength allows it to carry four to five people into the air. Uh, the island of Daist was the ancestral home of the wyvern. A knight named Han visited the island, and over a period of 30 years, he cultivated a bond with the wyverns. Han later became the first dragoon. Uh, once long ago, a king ordered the making of an indestructible lock and key. Three sets were fashioned, the first forged from friendship, the second from love, and the third from wonder. The sets forged from friendship and love were soon broken, but the third was wrought from the wonder evoked by the ringing of a single pure note, and it held fast. That key was the goddess bell. So pleased was the king, he hid the bell away in a cavern of snow where it rests to this day. Uh, in a time before the world knew castles or kingdoms, a star fell to the land now called Kashwan. A man gathered flame from the star and built an altar to enshrine it. Okay. Uh, recent technological advances produced the airship. Should these technical parts proliferate, they could one day drive magic from this world. Mithril is strong, easily processed metal, highly responsive to magic. It forms the basis of magical armaments. Okay. Welcome back, karaoke girl. Were you able to uh, secure yourself a nice cozy beverage and a snacky poo? 
All right, uh, you want to break the seal in the tower. Yes, I agree this is the time. We'll do nothing to stop you. You must first collect the two masks, then travel to a certain cave somewhere on this continent. Within, you shall find a crystal rod, an artifact you will need if you were to enter the tower. Word. Oh, that's the church. Uh, you did? Okay, and you got a little bit of cleaning up done. Excellent. Yep, yesterday I did quite a, quite a bit of laundry myself. Getting things put away for the uh, win summer and getting ready to get stuff out for the winter. So we need to give you the white mask. It looks like a transformer. <laughs> you place the white mask on the statue. Beautiful. All right, so I think we are all set in Mesidia. The next thing is to get the black mask in the cave on the little deserted island. So let's uh, save our game and head back to our ship. Oh look, a Marlboro! I know those. These weapons are a little bit better than I had for sure. Look at that damage. We are doing well. A ghost. That doesn't look like a ghost to me, Final Fantasy 2. That looks like a skill. Birdie! Sea snakes. Look, it's Gyarados. <laughs> punch, punch, slash, slash. Oh, there's the buccaneers. They are so cute. They're just like the pirates. Layla, we love your friends. They are so cute. Hi. So I'm going to take a quick peek at the guide here. So your next section is a small island. Find it without viewing the world maps. This one contains far more branches and paths that weave between floors. It's easy to get lost if you don't keep track of how you got to each floor. There are many cat treasure chests, and the majority of them are natural remedies made from vegetation that grows throughout the island. You'll find many important key items if you look hard enough. Okay. The enemies are not too fearsome, primarily consist of a certain set. You'll encounter a number of dual heads and dual deeds, as well as were rats and stunners. Neither of these should present a problem. You'll also encounter red mooses and jellies, very resistant to physical attacks. Red is weak to thunder, while yellow are weak against fire. While it's easy to cast the spells, the frequency was running them, you use up your magic passing likes, consider running from them. Deeper down the cave, you'll encounter slightly stronger enemies. First floor contains a number of small rooms. Oh, and there's like a shop down there? Oh, interesting. 
Uh, not the equipment's good as the equipment you can get in the city. Uh, well, let's look at this map, shall we? Oop. Wrong button. High drops, high potion. Oh, that's a really tiny map. <laughs> so the items are a high potion and ether. All right, so the first floor doesn't really have anything worth worth working hard for. The ether, maybe. Oh, where's the ether? The ether is letter D. Yeah, not worth it. I'm not going to worry about it. This is not a 100% completion run. <laughs> oh, they said they should run from these. Flee. 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 They're cute though. Oops, didn't mean to run again. Okay, I guess we're running again. Let's go! <laughs> Sometimes I forget I've got the auto battle button on. Ooh, that one was definitely a uh, run. We don't waste our magic. These I can take. Oh yeah. These are nothing. They not so tough. Oh. I see what they mean. They don't really take physical hits. <laughs> oh no! What a pain in the booty! Goodness. Flee. 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 Let's not waste our time. Okay. So that's floor one. Floor two has... Sleep grass, a scourge tome, a blind tome, a scourge tome, and another blind tome. Ooh, and there's two staircases. What's the difference between the staircases? Uh, let's look at floor three. Oh, well, that's not a really helpful map, is it? I'm really glad I'm playing this on the Pixel Remaster. I don't think I would like the original graphics for this game. Is that anything cool I just picked up? No. So we're going to just go down this first staircase and see what we got. Okay, so it's just, just taking us down.
So many dual heads and deeds. My defense is really high. That's fabulous. I love it. Layla's starting to catch up a little bit with her hit points. Okay. So it's taking us back up. Oh, my bad. We need to run. Maybe not. They don't really hit me either. Might as well kill them off. There, there. Come on, guys. You can do it. I believe in you. There you go. Maria is so awesome. We stand Maria. 69. Nice. I think that's where I want to be. Ooh, what have we here? Where are you coming from? Oh, look at your weird face. Why are you not wearing a mask? Oh, look at your weird face. I don't know. I don't have a mask, bro. The black mask is our treasure. We keep it at the bottom of cave. You keep it your hands off. No matter, you can't find it, so you not take it. Kick, kick, kick. What can I do for you? Oh. None of these are better than what I already have. Okay. Thank you. You're welcome. That's a cute little village. Okay. So it wasn't the wrong direction, but it also wasn't the right direction. Poison toads. Oh, those look just like the froggies in Final Fantasy XIV. It's funny. Takes you back, huh? So this game came out in what, 1989? I think so. I'm older than this game, if that's true, by one year. <laughs> Much. Okay, so this was the original floor I was on. So we want to go over to the staircase over there. Holy cow, look at those rats. Alright, while this auto battle goes, I'm going to be right back for just a moment. So I encourage you all to refill your beverage and grab a little handy snack, and I will be right back in just a moment.
I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. I wonder if I've gotten any more corn since I was gone. Let us see. Ooh, I'm feeling 75% corn now. <laughs> I think I got 73 earlier. Yeah, 73. So I got 2% more corn. That's great. All right, so there's a treasure chest over here. Not that I really need it. Bye, Toad. Nice knowing ya. Thanks for the antidote, buddy. That's good. Punch. Slap. Punch. Kick. Bum bum. So many rats. Cave is just riddled with them. I like their little stripes and their tails though. That's kind of cute. Pew. Since we're over here, we'll get the chest. Oh. 69. Specifically, Maria does 69 damage to the red moose. <laughs> it's an odd number to choose, Square Enix. Very odd. Layla only does 62. Not even close to Maria. Maria is just the best character ever. Alright, so... So we're gonna fight four big horns, stronger versions of the wild horns. They have no special attack. Cast blink, protect, or berserk, heal any damage, focus on one at a time until they are removed. Okay. <laughs> Wrong button. Ooh, Dark Man's going after the Makuhita, huh? I got garlic. We'll make some pasta. Yay, you got it! You got the Pokemon. <laughs> so... McDonald's locally, um, they're doing the Pokemon Happy Meals again this year, and for some reason the signs, uh, you know, you can only get one toy per order or something, because people like to try to get as many as they can and collect them. Somebody spelled it Pokemon, M-A-N. <laughs> I politely tried to inform them that their sign was incorrect and they rudely were not happy. 
<laughs> and it hasn't been changed, so it still says Pokemon. <laughs> Makes me think of uh, Linda from Bob's Burgers. Oh, Pokemon! All right, where's my items? We need an antidote stat. Maria is poisoned. Somebody's poisoned the main character. Ooh, 74. Good job, Perion. And Maria's still clutch with her 69 dammies. Get it. Nice. Oh, he ran. Bye. <laughs> it's such a waste of time. He doesn't hit. I don't hit. He doesn't hit. I don't hit. Okay. Now the choice matters. Alright, so we're on B4. Do, do, do. So there's a thousand gil in that chest up there. It's not really worth it, honestly. A thousand gil I can get in a in a campaign. Uh Kirkira Mion has been making you pick him up happy meals. <laughs> How am I not surprised about that? <laughs> Don't make poor life choices now. Why not, Emmy? I I I've gotta figure out what's the right step. So the black mask is going to connect to the letter L on the map. Oh, you want a Happy Meal? <laughs> I haven't had a Happy Meal in quite some time. Guess it doesn't matter, does it? Somebody should string these maps together better. Take the staircase closest to the upper right corner, be taken to the large room. Okay. So we want to go here, I think. So I guess we'll grab that chest because we're going to head that way anyway. Uh, you rather like the size of a Happy Meal and the apple snacks? Yes. I know. I kind of miss growing up when they had the little cookies. They were cute. October 18th, they're bringing back the old Halloween pails. Ooh, that sounds cute. Such an adult, you want to get a Happy Meal that day. That's okay. If you don't want to be an adult today, that's totally fine. Because <laughs> I certainly have my days. <laughs> oh, look at the rhino. It's cute. So this is what we're going to be fighting, just much stronger. It's adorable. Oh, can I run? Yes, I can. Run, girl, run! Good job. We lived again. So there's a door. Got a sleep tome. Another rhino! Aww. He's really cute. Poison toads, not so cute. Oh, look at him. He's so cute. 
All right, let's let's do some heal, shall we? We're not going to be using magic for you, so let's waste it all on cures. Perfect. Everybody's cured. Oh my gosh. Ready? Here we go. It got mask. Yes, it does, guy. Very smart. <laughs> what do you got? Do, do, do. Flick stone. Curse. Death. I don't think he has anything I want to use. Fog? No. He's just gonna attack. You are going to cast Berserk. You will cast Protect. And I guess you'll just attack. Is there anything I have that I would use? Sleep. Poison. Confuse. Let's use that. See what happens. Oh, got two of them. That's right. Kill your friends. Oh, they're not confused anymore. All right, you're going to attack. You will give Berserk to Layla. You will use Link. And you will attack. Guy is such a smart humble. Yes. Wonder what Holy does at this level. Let's try it out. Twenty-seven damage. Not a lot. I figured I'd try it. Heck yeah. Holy makes you take the enemy to church. Yeah, evidently. You found the black mask in the chest. Congratulations. Do you want to leave? Yeah, we do. Alright, so now we need to find the Mycidian Cave. The damage is emotional! Oh no! Emotional damage. Yeah, someday I'll play around with um, sound alerts. I've got to get to 50 followers, I think, and then have some people chitter chatting uh, consistently in stream, and then I can do affiliate stuff like sound effects. So I'm not quite there yet, but that is definitely one on the list. <laughs> All right, so the Cave of Mycidia. Where is the Cave of Mycidia? C, Mycidia Cave. Oh, okay. I see it. All right. So we need to head back to the inner circle. I really didn't use a lot of my magic at all during that... Uh, Dungeon. My characters are pretty fit to fight. Burb.
Burp. <laughs> Killer fish. Spoopy. Spoopy fishies. Them teeth are scary though. It looks like the fish are flying though, not just, you know, floating in the water. Let's go rest in Altair real quick. It's still so filthy from the bombing. Ta-da! Guys don't have a chance. Okay, so the cave is in that circle down there. Ooh, mines and bombs. This sounds like death to me. Let's see. Well, one died. Yeah, 300. Feel oh, pretty bad. I wonder if the mines are worse. So, we want to go in this little clearing, and then I think our dungeon is over here. Ooh, a cockatrice. They're kind of cute. Their feathers are pretty. Almost iridescent. Cure yourself, girl. And we're gonna do a quick save here. And we're gonna head into the Mycidia Cave. What do I need to know? Find some incredible black magic tomes not available anywhere else in the game. There are many seemingly inaccessible chests behind walls, but every chest can be obtained provided you find the fake wall. Do you see one? Okay. Make sure you have someone who can cast Asuna and Basuna at level 5 or above? I don't have that. <laughs> I have Basuna level 1 and Asuna level 1. Um, I don't think I'm ready for that then. I'm gonna get closer to Mysidia. Asuna. Oh no. You've got Asuna. Guess these are not the enemies to be messing around with. It's 
so it won't work? Huh. Alright, we definitely need to stock up on some of those. So. Asuna, Asuna. Protect. Magic Basuna. Asuna, Protect, Thunder. Basuna, Asuna, Protect, So I'm curious if it's going to level it, even if I'm not curing a status effect. Alright, that's everybody. It did level it. Sweet. So I probably need to give two go-arounds for that. Oh, I'm not gonna have time. Put these bombs. At least they drop money. A behemoth? What? <laughs> All right. Just a wild behemoth on the map. It was a boss earlier. It's really interesting how this game recycles bosses and turns them into just ordinary encounters you're gonna have. They're a pain in the butt. <laughs> Yeah, evidently I cannot proceed, according to the guide, without a level 5 Esuna and a level 5 Basuda. So, we're gonna try to get those going. Which I can't use here. Um... So is Basuna for battle? That we're off after battle. Okay. And her thunder's about to be leveled. Okay. Oops. These I just need to kill. Oh wow. They choose to slam me and not just self-destruct. Interesting. And he's trying to run. He got scared. Just curious, is the marsh a different enemy group? Oh, it certainly is. Oops, I'm attack. Okay.
They are not easy to kill, are they? Magic. Basuna, magic. Isuna, magic. Idea, magic. Thunder. So we're just gonna let them go. He can actually use his thing. That did nothing. How about your basu now? Nothing. I can't even cure a little poison. Try to run. <laughs> Try again. Um, actually, we'll get another protect here. And get these black guys out of the way. They're a little tougher than the red guys. Slash slash. No? Still alive. Okay. Magic, Basuna, Asuna, how about a blink, and give yourself a cure. A blink and a cure.
Nope. Nope. I gave it back to Maria. <laughs> All right. Beat him up, beat him up. All right, my Basana and Essena and Thunder are all leveled up. Sweet. So, can you use Essena outside of battle? You can. Okay. Your cares level six. Your cure is level 5. Protect. Your protect's level four. So we gotta get your blink up. Oh, more bums. Wow, a thousand damage. That's fabulous. Black plan. So what is Black Flan weak to? FF2 Black Flan weakness. The weakness is fire. Okay. Where are these got fire? Spells. Give me poison, thank you. Get this magic leveled up after all. Oh, look, their fire spells leveled up. <laughs> Everybody's curious level six. Sweet. Our fire spam. All right, slow the fire spam. 
I think these guys are weak to thunder. Thunder, thunder, thunder. Wow, well, they melt. Alright, play this fire level up. We'll take it. And our MP points down. So hopefully that means we'll get some more MP in battle. So we're gonna just take these guys out. We ain't messing around. They turn you to stone. And I can't cure it yet. Alright, back to our fire spam. Poison me. Come on. Do it. No? Love poison. Just like I'm working on leveling up my ability. Building your blink. Yeah, cure for everybody. Oh my gosh, it worked. Hooray. Let them go for a little bit. Maria has so much MP. That's right, drain that MP. Oh, 
No, she just attacked because she's out of me. <laughs> That's interesting. That's okay. You can kill it, Layla. It's fine. If you can kill it. missed again. Oh, Furion's out of MP now. There it goes. Alright, I got a Suna and Blink to level up. <laughs> Look at the MP boost. Perfect. And Spirit went up. That's what we need for magic. Oh, he's out of MP. <laughs> Excuse me, coming through. Let's take a peek. So is Basuna's almost to level three. Your Esuna is at level three. All right, not too bad. And you're going to work on, you got your blink to three, protects. And we'll continue to work on getting your blink up. And you could use getting your cure up, okay. Ooh, brains. Gonna take those guys out. Okay. I don't know if he really does anything, but we're gonna just spam these spells. pretty good on the HP. Sorry, this is boring, guys. But I gotta get my spells leveled up. You gotta get strong. So that way, if I get stoned, it's not as scary. I wonder what that pod does. Hmm. Oh wow. He swapped his... That must have been what that... One spell does. Swap. That is kind of scary, huh? Alright. Well, uh, Basuna leveled up and Cure leveled up. Uh, Furion got 20 more MPs. Spirit, Magic, Stamina. Maria got more magic and MP. Guy, nice. You got quite a bit there. And Layla got a little more MP as well. <laughs> Suna Matata. 
I don't know what spell that is. Um, what status is that? I don't know. Um, it's not confusion. What is that? How do I know? Status? Do, do, do. Um, conflict? Ooh, that's kind of cool. You get scan lines. Someone was telling me that you can change the, um, the font on this game. I don't see the option. Must be when you open it. Keyboard settings. Uh, you are now 85% decluttered for your cabin. Oh, that's so nice. That's a good feeling. I gotta work on some decluttering myself. All right. Guess I'm gonna try to rest and see if it's gonna help. It is a great feeling. Oh yeah. I've got a bunch of items. We were gonna have a garage sale. This was pre-COVID. <laughs> Didn't happen. So I've got a bunch of items that I need to just load up into my car and donate. So I'm hoping to do a little bit of downsizing here in the near future myself. Venom and poison. There's darkness. Um. Curses, amnesia. Is it amnesia? Do I need to hit her with a mallet? Yep. <laughs> okay. <laughs> You've given up on garage sales. Karaoke Girl says just fill up the truck and take it to the charity store. Yeah. Yeah, my partner, he has a hard time letting go of things. He's a school teacher, and as you know, with teachers, they keep everything. <laughs> it has a use! Uh, I know, I did noggin- hit her right on the noggin. It seemed to work. Okay, so... You're gonna continue your boss in a spam. And your S in a spam. And got her blink to level three. So I guess we'll do that. And we'll have you attack one of the brains. We don't need that many brains. And there's the swap. Attack. Oh, out attack. You're gonna continue your asana. You continue your asana. And you, my friend, cast blink. And you attack that brain. Get it. Used to donate to the teachers? Absolutely. They need all the help they can get. Magic. Asuna. Magic. Blink. Magic. Why don't you work on curing guy? Yeah, grats, Starkmail. Catching your Cherubi. Getting all the mons. spell I want to work on with you. I'd like to get your holy up, but that's not going to happen anytime soon. This will continue working on Blink. And Layla will continue to cure. And we're just going to spam that.
Uh, how do you copy the link stream in case you talk someone into a raid here? Uh, it is just Twitch. Oops, I'm in all caps. Uh, Twitch. That TV. Slash effector of change. So if they want to raid, they actually use a command. It's called raid. And then they put in my username. So I'm going to just kind of pretend. Uh, I don't know if this is going to do it. Oh. So imagine the slash is going... Oh, no. Are you not going to let me do it? <laughs> so... Yeah, it would be with the, yeah, bracket raid, my name. I just, it won't let me put the bracket in. So much bossa known as soon as. Well, there's the swap. I guess that is kind of a handy spell, isn't it? I just have a feeling if I took it, I would just end up missing. Kill the brain. Essena and Blink leveled up. Word. Marion got some more MP, stat bonuses. Maria's getting some stat bonuses. This is working out pretty faint. Sweet, sweet, sweet. MP is up. Okay. Oh, you're out of MP. <laughs> <laughs> and now you're not an MP, but everybody's filled. Okay. So let's go rest up again, get our MP filled. So I'm going to keep spamming this for a little bit just till we get these abilities up. I probably should have done this a while ago. I was trying to prog the story. I don't know of any other strat to level up my spells besides what I'm doing right now. Uh, we want to do a fire spam here. Get rid of these flan. So there's just one left. down the casting. Beautiful. Alright, so you can do it as a group heal. Okay. Uh you got your blink to four, you got your protect to four. Um Is there another spell I want to work on with you? How about silence? And then have you just spam care? Care? Sure.
So while that spam is going, I'm gonna go over to my Google and see how to power up spells in FF2. See if there's a better strategy. So get into battle with a weak enemy. Kill there's only one left. Just have your character start casting support spells on themselves. If you're trying to level up spells like teleport, cast them on yourself so that the battle doesn't end. Once you have your characters casting, put something on the A button to make it cycle. Oh, uh, yeah, go make some coffee, come back later, heal and repeat. Okay, so this is literally the strat. So stronger monsters will level up faster, especially bosses. Try Mysidia, doesn't matter. It's really the only way to go. Battles will take forever, but if you use the spell like 20 times in one battle, you'll see the results. Okay. Anyone else have other comments? Is there a fast way to level up magic in two? Levels are high enough, probably call that and stop getting NSP. You'll have to resort to killing your own party. For ultimate casters, you want weapon skills, and all spells at level 16. So health on. Ideally, you want an enemy that's immune to your spells. That makes sense. You would cast fire repeatedly. Alright. Oh, Layla's getting down there with her cures. Ultima's considered white magic. That's interesting. So if Minwu uses it, damage is only based on spirit. Fascinating. I wouldn't have thought it'd be a, a white spell. That's kind of cool. Well, not gonna get that spell. So it looks like I pretty much, in terms of magic, encounter just about every spell that you can get in the game, besides like ultimate magic. Okay. So that means we're not too far from getting through this game. Because I think after this, we've got to do the Mesidian Tower. The Cyclone, Palamecia, and then Pandemonium. So, we're actually more than halfway through this uh, playthrough. Alright. I think I'm ready to end this battle. Well, maybe not. Let's do... Continue my Boston and SMS ban. And how about you? Let's have you cast... Hmm. How about Dispel? No. 
Could do holo. Could do slow. Oh, it's dead. Didn't matter. Both Boston and Esther level. Guy leveled up silence. Layla leveled up cure. Look at that MP. That is the strap. So you were just leveling up, boss. I'm at level four. My Asuna is, in fact, level five, so I can stop stop hers. Oh, I start using warp. <laughs> Who has death? Piran has death. So I'm gonna keep using his boss in a spell. Um, oh, she does have the toad spell. Then I can have you working on... Protect? I guess we can get that protect up level five. Okay. We're to rest up and do it again. Rinse, wash, and repeat. Save my game. Oh, but not with bums. Oops. Well. <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. More black plan. Spam some fire. Beautiful. Oh, he's trying to run. That's rude. So, you are still working on Boston, huh? My SM is up. So what do we want to work on for you? Another dimension. Berserk would be nice to level up. Let's get my Berserk up. And then you will work on... I want you to level Holy. And we'll have Layla offsetting that with some heals. I wish you could track the progress of the skill in battle instead of having to exit the battle to see what the level is at. It would make it a little more convenient. And the boss is not working because that only takes care of ones when you're in battle. Whereas Asuna is needed when you're out of battle. So I wonder if the level 5 would take care of the stone status effect now. Adam. 
Oh, magic. Protect. Where's Asuna? So Asuna cannot, must be at least a level of the status level. For example, Stone cannot be cured unless it's above level 5. Very low chance of reviving knocked out allies at 7 or above can be on sets. So stone is at the level. Yeah. How did you know which level it is? Yeah. Yeah, it'd be nice to get a play. That's a good one. So much berserking. Got a Berserk, Holy, and Fire Up. Okay. I'll take it. And some more MP Magic and Spirit. MP and Magic. MP Magic Spirit. Nice. That's cool. Oh, your cure's almost maxed out. Level 7 cure. It's pretty good. So his boss is level 4. I think I'll go one more battle. Perfect. In a spam. Oops, we're gonna have Berserk. Um, what about Stun? That sounds like a good one. And. Oh, yeah, we were working on Holy. Oh my gosh, Cure Level 6. Yeah, we'll have you do a cure spam. to get that holy leveled up.
and she's out of magic. Not Maria or Guy. <laughs> they are slinging spells. It's kind of cool. Slowly chipping away. Come on, Layla, you can do it. I believe in you. There you go. They still have so many MP points. <laughs> Got our Basana and stun up. Guy leveled up his fire. Got both MP and HP there. Shriek. Maria didn't get any MP. Shocker. She has 300. <laughs> oh, guy went up too. Cool. Level seven. That's ridiculous. Oh, he's out of MP. All right. Uh, guy, do your thing. Beautiful. So that officially got me Bossina five and Essena five. So I think we can try and go into the cave now. And I bought, I think, a bunch of golden needles, too. Okay. Werewolf. Those are new. Thanks for uh, sitting through the grind with me, folks. <laughs> oh, Black Glen. I wonder if it's 300. I wonder if that is, that's the max uh, MP you can get. Fire, 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 fire. Man, MP is capped at 9.99. That is okay. So they can definitely get more. Good to know. This weird strength went up. Some more for you. They're tough. I 
And he's still casting. Well, at least your fire leveled up, buddy. So many black plans in this forest. That is enough to kill it. What a shame. Sooner you can. Run. Escape. All right. Cave of Mysidia. Many simians with chest playing wall. Every chest can affect the obtain. So, from the entrance, climb the steps to the left. Walk all the way down the top of the floor until you can climb down into the small chamber below. Open the chest, then return to the top of the floor. So you're saying go all the way. This chest? Okay, so you're saying go for this chest. I will go for that chest then. More brains. I remember these. That swap skill is deadly. Spectres. Luckily, they take physical well. Uh, karaoke girl wants a wine rack. That'll get rid of three boxes. <laughs> Certainly would. Black garb. Guards against physical ailments like stone. So we want to put that on Maria because she has um, a spell for that. I want to put flame armor on anybody else? No. So now Maria is protected from stone. Hopefully. See the chest, small chamber, and the black guard. You collect wines, not on purpose, but they're great to have in hand for a dinner party or a housework. Yeah, wines are definitely helpful. You should uh, talk to Emmy. Emmy has a very strong love of wine. <laughs> oh my gosh! Bulb Boy, two raids, I think, in a week. Goodness. Well, come on in, folks. Welcome. How was your stream? Uh, folks, if you're new, uh, I'm Effector of Change. I uh, use Hebe pronouns, casual, uh, JRPG, uh, retro, cozy, queer streamer, basically. I haven't really picked a total personality yet, but here I am. Uh, right now I'm getting through Final Fantasy II, the Pixel Remaster. Uh, been playing Tomba 2 as well. Uh, hello, you have to go pee. I'll be back really quick. Okay, well. Let's do a quick shout out then for the Bulba Boy. If y'all aren't following, you should be. Holden is a special little bean. <laughs> uh, does all sorts of cool things like Zelda. Um, I think I saw him do uh, Stray. That was a pretty cool game to see streamed. Um, Bulba is fabulous and we love him. And he was just playing Stardew. That sounds awesome. I have a cozy streamer I really enjoy, and so I've been learning a bit more about Stardew. I've never completed a full year. I've only dabbled just a wee bit, just a wee bit. 
Um, but welcome. Come on in, raiders. Uh, if you need to raid and run, totally understand. Uh, if you want to stick around, get a snack, get a little beverage, and just chill out. It's uh, Thursday night. No reason to be up all late. <laughs> we are just getting into this cave. Um, of Mysidia to try to get some magic spells and a black I don't know I think I got the black mask but we need to put it in here somewhere get in that cave I am Holden thank you <laughs> beating up these birds as I go Interesting, it seems the mobs in this dungeon are not too different than the ones that I was just fighting in the Overland. Oh, is that the Marlboro? I don't remember seeing many Marlboros. They're a pain in the butt. Ooh. You got him, Mr. Brain. That was rude. Poor Furion. <laughs> That's why we have Layla. Layla will help. Golden hairpin. All right. Is there anybody who wants to wear a golden hairpin? You're wearing one. How's FF going? It's going pretty good. Um, you guys actually just missed the boring leveling up my spells portion of Final Fantasy. Uh, now we are actually getting into this dungeon, thankfully. <laughs> I think he could use that more. 70, 48, uh, 70, 66. Yeah, we'll give, no, we'll give it to her. Maria is my favorite character in this game, hands down. She is fabulous and we love her. She does everything. All right, so I am like I mentioned, a cozy streamer, so I've got a little strategy guide. So with this particular game, it is my first playthrough. If you've played Final Fantasy II before, you are welcome to backseat as much as you'd like, because I have no idea what I'm doing here. <laughs> Slowly mumping my way through, uh, and I've got a little strategy guide up to the side to help me avoid the unavoidable trip pitfalls. So we're going to make our way to the lower left corner of the floor to climb down some steps. Okay. Do I see steps? There are steps. Oh, I got to go back up. Okay. Guess we're just going to open these doors. This guide is not helping me. <laughs> oh no, more flans. <laughs> I don't want to deal with friends. I don't want to waste my precious MP on these guys. I made it. I mean, I don't know if you were paying attention earlier, but uh, Karaoke Girl was talking about her need for a wine rack. Ah. <laughs> uh. Make your way to the lower left corner of the floor. Climb down the stairs, find the top of the gang, a little clown of fear, and slow journey. Doppelganger, proceed. Okay. So the guide is saying I need to go to the bottom left. Yes, and we are located uh, in the beautiful Finger Lakes region of upstate New York, home to so many wonderful wineries. <laughs> <laughs> You've got some great wine stored cozily in ugly boxes. Oh dear. <laughs> well, just know if you uh, ever decide you want to take a trip in the summer up here, Karaoke Girl, we will do a wine tour. There's so many good ones up here. Emmy says, when I moved my BFF Becca, we had about three cases of wine she had into her new house. Well, Becca is also a winemaker, so that makes total sense for her to do that. <laughs> I 
That's her profession. Ooh. That was rude. Why you put me to sleep? He will do that. All right. Uh, Becca had a bottle of wine half as tall as she is. I am not surprised by this information. Oh, look! He looks like me. Yeah, they did an amazing job, Bulba, on the music for Final Fantasy II Pixel Remaster. Uh, the doppelganger is motionless. The purity of Furion's heart is stifling, defile the heart of the creature. So we're gonna put on the black mask. The mask and the creature both vanish. Sweet. All right, we made it to floor two. Where do we got some treasures? I'm doing a stream in time. That's okay. So the door which leads to the next floor is found in the lower left corner again. But before you head there, search the floor for two powerful weapons. In the top center tree, you'll find the power staff. Or the map, it looks and close the walls. There's a fake wall near the bottom you can pass through. Get the flame lance. I think I have the flame lance already. Uh, Emmy says Bulba should uh, do some Final Fantasy. Music's always banging. Uh, agree. Have an idea for a series after Zelda. Thinking Final Fantasy. Yes, Bulba, you should do the Final Fantasy series. The pixel remasters are fabulous if you're going to get through the first six of them. Although, I haven't decided when I get to six because it is my favorite of the Final Fantasy games. If I'm going to do pixel remaster or go to a different version. But I've heard that the music especially the opera scene, is really awesome. So I'm thinking I probably will go with the remaster just to get the scenic uh, enjoyment. Uh, Karaoke Girl has a, in New Mexico, some great old wineries, old Spanish vineyards, and amazing port. Oh, nice. Yeah, we mostly have grapes and a lot of breweries up here, a few distilleries. Uh, yeah, they are fairly priced. I don't think they were too bad when I bought them. So, where are our chests? So there was one up there, and then there's one there. Oops. Ooh. We got brains, changers, parasites, and Marlboros. Icky ickies. Ooh, he's got a little bit of absorption. Oh no. Are they gonna turn me to stone? Please don't turn me to stone. They turn one of me to stone. One I can handle. If everybody turns to stone, it's a game over. And it's really annoying. <laughs> Golden Needle. I think I have a power staff, don't I? I think I have several of them. Yeah, they're equipped with them. Ooh, Black Flans ambushed. We're gonna run away from these guys. Not a fan. Not a fan. They were great for leveling up earlier, though. But the only way to kill them is to spam fire attacks. Oh, Fell survived the hurricane! Yay! That's awesome. I was um watching some folks on Snapchat and TikTok. You know those Floridians. <laughs> they uh they seem to just brave the elements. The guide was correct. There was a secret path. 
I was rooting for Florida Man as well. I was quite concerned. I don't know what part of Florida Fell is on, but I hope it wasn't the bad side <laughs> where that hurricane hit. It's terrifying. Oh, he's in Fort Ma Yeah, I think that's where the bad stuff was. There were sharks in the streets. Isn't that like the plot for Sharknado? <laughs> Oh, Baba, enjoy your lurk. Thank you for joining. Um, I'm glad that you're here. And uh, thanks for sticking around. Appreciate it. Helps the stream a little bit. All right. Gonna go over to this door. More black plan? Nah. We running. We's running. I can take them on, I just don't want to waste my MP on them. Oops. I've got more gill now that I know what to do with. When I first started this game, it was like... change in my pockets. I had no money. <laughs> You know, I'm glad I put the mask on the deity uh, in Nisidia, because I don't think that doppelganger would have let me through. Rude. Ooh, a Grimer appeared. Stinky. So this is two more powerful weapons. When you arrive, walk through the water. Take the steps up and out. Looks blocked, but you find an entrance on the right wall to access the chest to get the ice bow. Okay. It feels so tough now. There we go. Ice bow. Ooh. All right, they gave him amnesia. It's an interesting effect, the little question mark. I think it just means I don't have control of him, but he doesn't necessarily attack me. He's like confused. It's weird. Yes, we will hit you upside the head with our mallet. <laughs> oh, that's cute. Okay. Walk down the right side. Ogre killer axe. There's going to be a fight with some bombs. And head left. Where do you go? From here, across the body, and punches. Head left along the bottom so you head up and around to the stairs that lead to the next floor. I don't see stairs that lead to the next floor. Do you see stairs? I don't see no stairs. Huh. Must be that door? There certainly are not stairs. So many undeads. Some of them are kind of scary. I forget what status effect they inflict, but I think they almost wiped my party at one point. Spoopy. Very spoopy. Kaboop. 
cabin. Monsters. Bombs. Not so scary. I haven't encountered them in the wild. They do hurt. But I can handle that. That's fine. So what is the ogre killer? Do I already have one? It's an effective against giant enemies. Oh, I already have one. Oh my gosh. Plunge, a raid, a raid. Welcome, welcome. Hello, raiders. Let's give a shout out to Plunge. How was your stream, friend? Welcome, raiders. Uh, if you don't know me, I am the effector of change. Uh, my pronouns are he, they. I am a cozy queer streamer right now doing some Final Fantasy II, the Pixel Remaster. Um, welcome in, Raiders. Yeah, we are just kind of getting along. Uh, raiders, if y'all need to raid and run, totally understand. So make sure you do some self-care, get a nice beverage, a little snack. And if you want to hunker in and hang out with us, you're welcome to that as well. Um, yeah, so we're uh, in the midst of this cave from Isidia to get some more magic. Because this game at this point is now all about getting the ultimate magic. <laughs> Feels good to be back. Yeah, I noticed you were gone for a little bit from the stream, and I'm glad to see you're back in your routine. So if y'all aren't following Plunge, make sure you give them a follow. Oh, Red Mage Dove, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome. Uh, Plunge does a lot of variety retro gaming. Uh, comes cool spinning of the wheel. Uh, so it kind of jumps between different games as he goes. Uh, I have a streamer that was trying to convince him <laughs> to do The Legend of Zelda uh, randomizer for Ocarina of Time. I think he would have fun with that. Uh, yes, Red Mage is in fact the best mage, I mean, That is correct. That is correct. <laughs> you get a glump. Because that is so true. Although, I gotta say, um, as a Red Mage in 14, I think I spend more time in raids rezzing people. <laughs> And I am worried about my damage. <laughs> uh. Yeah, red mages are awesome. So if you haven't played Final Fantasy II uh, Dove, you're basically a red mage in this game because you equally can learn black and white magic. And so your game forces you to be a red mage because otherwise you'll max out on, on damage and spirit halfway through the game. <laughs> halfway after your time is spent rezzing and the other half not getting comms. Yeah, that is that is a true statement. <laughs> oh, cool. So you've played recently. Awesome. Yeah, we're moving along pretty well. The leveling is definitely a unique mechanic. Well, I get comms, but that's because of the way my character's dressed. <laughs> that is true. That is true. Oh, that is true. Okay, that room is empty. Uh, Emmy's been playing Astro in Duties and gets the comms. Yeah. Healers always get the comms. This is true. <laughs> My character is an H-O, huh? I guess, if that's uh, that's the way you want to see it. Don't be jelly. Ooh, flying rays. These are new. The last round of them, you feel bad because you. Oh, poor kite! Don't kill kite. That's not nice. <laughs> I 
Yes, that is a true statement, Karaoke Girl. When they unlocked the uh, near raids in 14, and you could get the 2B leggings with the thong, and some random tune was in Gridania, and it was dyed. I was like, what? <laughs> Game changer. My red mage has been wearing them ever since. All right, B4, look. There's a multiple doors and a chest. It was a beautiful moment. It sure was. I'm so glad I could make you happy. <laughs> oh. All right, so you don't have a lot of choices here. You must walk south along the left portion until you can enter the narrow chamber. Head left. Oh, you can access the right. The chest near steps can have potion. And some more statues. Add as healing items. So proceed to the lower right corner to the floor to find the stairs to the next floor. So that's where we gotta go. I'm not even gonna worry about a potion, y'all. I... no. This is a first playthrough, not a completionist playthrough. <laughs> I think I made that decision... Um, to not go 100% when we did the Dreadnought and the Blood Sword, it wouldn't let me get it. It must have been there was a secret entrance or something. And that's a missable item. And so since I missed a missable item, I'm not too worried. I'm not too worried at all. The undead in this game, there's a lot of them. I'm still not quite sure why there were so many in the Empire. <laughs> That's strange. Oh, yellow soul. Hello, kitty cat. I hear you. Where are you? Hi, Amy. You just come inside? These ones aren't so bad, actually. Where do the black mooses? Ah, Emmy. <laughs> Hi, kitty. Do you want to come up? Hello. Hi, kitty cat. We're playing Final Fantasy. Hello. Sometimes she likes to try to lay right on my keyboard. <laughs> Not a good place for kitty cats to hang out. Where are you going? I know there's new games over there, huh? Uh, Zelda loves sitting on your keyboard, especially when working- Yup. That is a thing cats do. Anything that's not giving them attention. It's just funny to see- I mean, she tries to not lay specifically on the keyboard, but there's like a, a desk mat for my mouse and stuff. So she tries to lay between the keyboard and the monitor. <laughs> it's really kind of cute and annoying. So many undead. Kaboom. Yep, a potion. So the fifth floor is the last floor. Okay.
So it looks like that was actually a staircase maybe in the original games? Look at all them treasures. All right. So, as soon as you arrive on the final floor, you should notice the chest right, examine it to locate the drain tome. Doing so will force you into a fight with a set of ghosts, all of whom can demonstrate what drain can do by absorbing your HP. All right. I'm sure I can handle these ghosts. Ooh, curse. And stun. I think that is a doom mechanic. I don't know how many rounds it lasts. All right, they're dead. Whew. There's the drain tome. Absorbs HP when used in battle. Okay. And I think I need crosses to remove the curse. Perfect. Okay. Your ultimate destination is the upper left corner of the room. Okay. But if you have enough energy and supplies, there are five chests in the chamber along the portion of the floor. An energy can be found along the right wall of the chamber. In the lone chest in the bottom, you'll find the mini tome. All four chests along the top contain potions, but in the remakes they include high potions and an ether. Okay. That is cruel in the original game to put just potions up there. <laughs> Why would they do that? It's not nice. Ooh, a wild vanilla ship here. Do I have any more Pokeballs? I do. Did I end up... Ooh. No, no paralyzing. Ooh, no thank you. No thank you. <laughs> Come on. Can we run? Please let me run. Please, please, please no. Thank you. Okay. I caught it! Yay! I think Vanillish is the ice cream cone looking Pokemon. Somebody found the spot to hang. Okay. Good for you, Mimi. You can hear her licking. It's so aggressive over there. <laughs> Yuck. A potion, an ether, a high potion, and more bros. Yes, kitty. She's neglected, y'all. Punch, punch, punch. And a hot potion. Nice. All right, Layla, let's spam some cures, girl. Oh my god, she has no more mana. <laughs> Let's get you some MP. There you go. So we want to get back to that top corner. Okay.
why didn't that warn you to not read the UW general chat? Um, well, <laughs> sorry, apologies there. <laughs> kind of scary there the other day. <laughs> Fox has definitely been posting some silly, uh, silly pics. <laughs> he really should utilize the spoiler tag a little more often, I <laughs> So some folks can, uh, scroll on past and not be traumatized. <laughs> what kitty? You can come over here. Yes, yes. Theoretically to help they'll focus on things other than the hurt. Yeah. Nothing beats existential dread like inappropriate discord humor. We're just gonna keep running. We can run. We're gonna run. We ran in. Hey, Shane with a Y. Welcome to the stream. Hello. There's a little shout out for you, Shane. Come on in. We are uh, deep in the Mycidian Cave here in Final Fantasy 2. How's your evening going? Been having a good Thursday here. Things have been pretty chill. Pretty chill. Boop, boop, boop. Flying rays. I think I can take these guys. Ah, today was your Friday afternoon working, but it's a pretty quiet day. Okay. Yep, today is technically my Friday as well. I don't typically see folks on Fridays. Um... So, I'm ready for the weekend. <laughs> Although I did hard work today. I was able to clear out about, I don't know, 1,100, 1,200 emails and categorize them finally. Some of them dating back to 2020. I get a lot of solicitous email. But I felt really good when I saw that number go down. <laughs> Look at Guy's HP. He almost has 3,000. That is incredible. Not much brains, but boy can take a hit. Uh-oh. Why are there three chests? I don't like this. So you'll find a room with three chests. In the chest you'll find a second drain tome. Osmos. The purpose for your visit. The crystal rod. Okay. So, nothing to be scared of, thankfully. A Drain Tome, an Osmos Tome, and a Crystal Rod. Now we're Sailor Moon! Should I be putting these tomes on? Teaches Osmos, absorbs MP? Maria, do you have that spell? No. Neither do you. Let's have you forget... Um, what do I want you to forget? Stop? Stop never works. Yeah, forget that spell. And we're gonna have you learn mini. Okay. And Maria, our black mage extraordinaire, you are going to take Osmos. Okay. And then Furion, our jack of all trades, we will give you the drain tome. So there will be some spells for you. Uh, you originally played this on the PSP. Been so long. Have you been enjoying the Pixel Remaster? So I've never played Final Fantasy 2 before. 
so I don't really have much of a comparison to make personally. But the Pixel Remaster is definitely a fabulous uh, introduction. I have played 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 10, 2, 12, 13, <laughs> obviously 14, 15. Um, so all those ones, but I haven't played 2. And I've only played a little bit of 3, but I'm going to probably restart it so I can stream it once I complete this game. Um, so it's totally new for me, but I'm really, I'm really digging the vibe. It is similar, some of the elements with music and sound effects from the other Pixel Remaster game, because I finished the first one on stream, but I really, really quite enjoy it. Okay, magic. Maria, you have so much magic. We're just going to have you warp us up each floor. So I don't think that impacts your HP. No. Oops. Maria, you get us out of here, girl. Magic. Warp. Hello, Miss Evie. Are you trying to figure out how to get over here? You can come over here. It's fine. Hi. Not on the keyboard, though, silly. Nope, not in the keyboard. Yes, it is really stunning visually. That's a microphone, honey. Please hold. <laughs> Are you done? I'm still trying to figure out what you're doing. You don't know what you're doing? Okay. She doesn't know what she wants. I think she wants me to get off stream. <laughs> Is that what you want? Come here. Hello. Oh, hello. Hi. Hi. Have you been neglected today? Is that what you're trying to tell me? Do you feel neglected? Nobody loves you. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh. You're gonna leave your hair back. Yeah. So much work to get out of this game. All right, we got out, y'all. We got out. Good girl. Come on, we can run. Yes, Amy. Hello. Hi. You know, you're such an attention hog, huh? We running. We running. Let's get back to town. We running. I said we running. Okay, so let's rest up. Nine hundred and eighty-seven gil. Looks like we got beat up a little bit, huh? All right, so I think the next stage is to go into the Mesidia Tower. So I think I'm going to call the prog for now. I'm going to save my game. Their number CX. 
and call it there, folks. Get this screen switch. So let us see if we can find someone awesome to raid. Uh, suggestions are always welcome. I did recently start a Discord server, a little queer cozy community. Um, if you're interested in hanging out with us over there, there's the link. Um, I will probably post the VOD of this episode on the YouTubes tomorrow if you want to be interested in checking that out. And my socials are all there on my link tree. So if y'all would like to come along with our raid, here's our little raid message. If you want to copy and paste that into the browser, let me see if I can find someone for us to go visit and raid. <laughs> you know, my Twitch labels never updated, did they? Here, let me open that. Sorry about that, uh, Red Mage. Let me get that updated for you. Because <laughs> I think I hit 32 followers today. Which is fabulous. Definitely on that road to affiliate. Alright, so who's on? Do, do, do. Looks like Evil Emher is streaming Final Fantasy VII 8 Remaster. Another awesome Final Fantasy game. Uh, sure, if you got some options that you uh, would like, Shane, definitely. Who do you uh, think we should go visit? Nine is such a good game. I don't think I finished nine. So I think when I get through the series, that will be a good one to play. I have it on Steam, so it wouldn't be hard to stream it. All right, let's check out Soy Spell. Full-time otaku. <laughs> okay. She's awesome. Great energy. All right. I think we're going to go with Soy Spella. So again, if you want to uh, use the message, feel free to copy the one from right above. I'm going to initiate the raid to go see Soy Spella. So thank you for joining me on this stream. It's been a fabulous evening, and oh, what do you mean, invalid name? Raid. Soy Spella. It doesn't like that. What are you thinking, Twitch? Come here. There, oh, there it goes. All right, we got it. We got it, y'all. We got it. Thank you for joining. Take care. Bye.
to help introduce the device to patients and readers. And so if you guys would like to go next to the next